and welcome back to some more uh, Men of War. It's going to be a 4 vs 4 game on the countryside map, UK vs UK. So it's going to be one hell of a mirror matchup, and God knows who's going to be spawning with what. So I'll just get in some SMGs. Nice little standby there. There we go. Pick Demando, Copperate. Left to cap. He's of course going to be going for a diamond, which means he won't be able to cap right away. This tankman, I'm pretty sure I told him to fucking go here, but uh, there you go. Of course, he's not going to do that. And Alan on the right is going to be turning off Ruffman. Very nicely done. So there we go. We'll uh, see what our opponents will bring out. No doubt, I'll probably be seeing a few light vehicles for them. I guess I should leave one of my guys here to actually capture this freaking point. So a few more guys up, and yep, here comes a Tetrak, of course, and of course I can't afford that, damn it. Shit, I guess I should watch out. Oops. Let's get a six pounder there. Screw it. Six pounds I need. Oh, I suppose AC rifle would be pretty good, so. Yeah, let's see, I reckon three here should be alright. And of course, damn British bastards are going to be capturing this point, of course. Oh, fuck. Yeah, well indeed, they're walloping us early on. Uh, six pound or six, wow. Well, it's either that or send in a seven pound, 17 pound, and we can't exactly afford that just yet. So, how the hell can I not aim, aim up this fucking kill, I wonder? Uh, of course, it's probably because the damn thing's aiming down a bit. Uh, of course, it's going to freaking this again. Yeah, right, so I guess I have to capture this damn thing myself then. And there we go, finally taking this thing out. And of course this thing's going to probably take me... Ah, oh, never mind, take me out, that's very nice. Very nice, although we've lost um, basically all of our squads in the middle, which is just uh, freaking dandy. I suppose we might be able to get a free... Um, a dime there at the very least, that'd be pretty nice. And we're going to be able to capture this thing. Perfect, send a guy out there. Apparently my allies, the harassment on the left, are not really doing much there, which is just uh, freaking dandy. How the heck? Oh, of course, damn it, something might, must have hold destroyed it. Probably someone's AT gun. Possibly my own, just kept on firing. And, okay, he's back at the same. So, yes, um, like my videos and all that as well there. Uh, because yeah, he was away when I finished my previous game. This thing continuing to shoot a few shots here and there, why not? Oh, actually, this thing will come in pretty handy for taking out these uh, riflemen, actually. There we go, wow, that actually was an even better shot than I thought it'd be, I can Actually, uh, make use of that thing again and fucking Matilda. God damn, I probably should just move this thing up right now. Yes, I could do some help actually, it's at least. Could do some help indeed. Yeah, if, this thing's if this thing keeps coming up, I should be able to ambush it with my. Uh, holy shit, with my AT gun, that's a perfect shot. Okay, let's see. Can I aim up the hill? I sure can. How the hell is it? That's not going to take it out, I don't know. Okay, fuck it. So now that I revealed the sim course, now I'm going to have to send it up so I have any chances of actually taking a damn thing out. But, oh, and of course, Grey was going to be moving in his thing from the uh, left there. Not bad, not bad, nicely done. Oh, that's right, more infantry coming for me. I'll just send in a few tank men. Hopefully, six pounders will be able to do a bit of damage. Of course, 17 pounds. Look at that. It costs more than a medium tank. 28 points. I mean, granted, it's a pretty good AT gun, but uh, uh, I just wish they had something in the interim that we could freaking use. Guys, that's so much to freaking ask for. for six pounds at all things. Jesus. Uh, oh, well, anyway. Yeah, take those. That thing. Guess we'll uh, try to move this guy up a bit here. Try to get this guy to supposed to salvage. And yep, she's uh, coming. Ah, oh. damn it! V and he's great. Get instead of as okay. As it has a better gun, better front line, basically better everything. Sherman, eh? Really? Yeah, that's well. At least they managed to water away that stuff, I guess. So. Better than nothing, I guess. Actually, why did this guy salvage? Here we go. 
So what the hell, I guess we'll just uh, try to capture the points now after losing crap loads of guys there. And AT guns and such. Not bad, not bad. Very well, nicely done by um, our allies. Uh, our opponents, should I say. Definitely keep giving us uh, quite the uh, challenge indeed. What's the. Oh shit, of course the turtle will do that. <sighs> See, I'm surprised actually that Grey Wolf is even using a Sherman. This M4A1 Sherman isn't really that. Uh, that's great to say at least, but uh, yeah, what the? Actually, I'll just put this guy over here, maybe put this guy at the front. There we go. Might as well have the tankman in the uh, line of fire since he's a bit more expendable. Bam. Oh, there we go, even took out a few couple of uh, other guys, and ready. Pank for himself, it's not too shabby. <laughs> Keeping these guys a what for, though, we have to watch out, though. For uh, enemy tanks and all that. Oh, that's right, that's an Achilles, I think. For the time being, we'll send it to the right. Take out this Crusader slash oh, the Crusader AA2, and I suppose maybe I'll take out this Cromwell. But yeah, this would be a pretty good example as to why the um, oh good, 70 pounds, as to why the uh, Sherman sucks against compared to the Cromwell. Well, against medium targets anyway. Yeah, really? Okay, let's try that again. Then. It basically puts it has um, there we go, slightly worse. Front armor and a slightly worse main gun compared to the uh, to the Cromwell and the Cromwell I think even costs a bit less actually. Let's have a look. Twenty one compared to twenty. So, granted the Cromwell is lacking a few things, but uh, actually, what the hell? I even use a single to hunt out this uh, tank, whatever the hell it is, the uh, Matilda. Oh, and they've got their own Achilles. How's that? Ah, oh, of course, this thing's freaking open turret. I keep forgetting about that. Oh, what the hell, I'm feeling lucky. Let's uh, take this thing out and then take out the Achilles, hopefully. Ah, oh, interesting. Apparently, I he only got my turret or something like that. Stop that. <laughs> oh, this is good. Let's see if we can hold destroy so they can't freaking repair it. Okay, let's try that again. Just have to watch out for infantry, pretty good infantry. Sizing up my tank right there. Oh, for fuck's sake. Yeah, there we go, a bit of audacity. It never hurts, but now we got rocket men. It's stairs. shit. Wow. Two rocket men. Now there's something I don't see too often. <laughs> Incredible. Now, right, so let's send the infantry forward and see what I can salvage, I guess. Hopefully, some SMGs and all. And such. Although, damn it, of course, these guys can now repair their tanks, which is going to be freaking. Pain in the ass. Although I managed to take out most of the stuff, so I think I might just send in some storm troopers towards the middle. See if I can prevent the uh, stuff from being repaired. And uh, maybe also wreak a bit of havoc on, on the enemy's lines. But at least I don't have to worry about blowing that thing up. And that thing certainly did pay for itself. I just wish it's uh, hull destroyed the enemy's stuff rather than hull uh, crushing us. But that uh, oh, well, what can you do? So I keep sending him up here, and oh, for fu I told him to fucking run around. God, these assault infantry. Interesting. Does he really need help on the left? I wonder. I don't think he really does, to be honest. But uh, what the hell? Up to him. I suppose if he needs help, he can uh, specifically request a vehicle or something like that. And yeah, these guys will just have to. Get them up there. There we go. Jesus fucking Christ, indeed. And of course, yeah, these guys are going to get torn up now. What the answer oh, mortar? And of course, Churchill's not to contend with. Not bad. Yeah, I have to say, mirror matchups can be rather. Ah, <laughs> crappy crusade, yeah, of course. It can be rather interesting. Even with the same factions and all that. Just depends on, uh, you know, how good the players are and all that. And the yeah, guys just keep uh, hitting up and all that. Might as well. Uh, Separate my guys out a bit, so chances are they're probably repairing these things as quickly as possible. Just freaking dandy. That's, yeah, UK does get some nice things like the Achilles, the Archer, 17 pounder, and all that. 17 pounder starts to uh, fail a bit once the uh, heavier, oh, of course, once the heavier tier. 
stuff comes out, but before that happens, um, yeah, the 17 pounders are just incredible. Yeah, damn, of course, this guy's getting going to get screwed. Okay, there we go, these guys should be in a good position to just fire. There we go, bam, go. There we go, little two pronged assault, I suppose you could call it. <laughs> just wish those guys had a few, bit more uh, machine gun ammunition, but can you do it? And freaking artillery, of course. Damn artillery. And there goes... Okay, that's interesting. I wasn't expecting guy in our team to actually, to actually leave, but uh, they have it. Interesting. Uh, for fuck's sake. Guys. <laughs> yeah, not bad. Okay. Yeah, <laughs> cute. So no, I don't prefer kicking. Uh, hope it doesn't become necessary though. Achilles Archer, Shot Firefly. What's it go with? That's the question. Now I suppose I could just go with a simple Cromwell. I think it means Kim Jong Il or however they have a, how his name's pronounced. Not that, not that. And yeah, my other guy's just taken, getting taken out. Although, what the hell, I guess we'll have a bit more of an interesting game as a result. Great, we're coming in, in on the left. More guys coming in on the right. Actually, I might just send in my mortar as well. There we go. And freaking Daimler is coming as well. God damn Daimler, I gotta love them. Oh well, anyway, let's just take this bastard out. Oh shit, wait a minute. I'll be able to get a flanking shot on the Sherman, maybe. Ah, fuck. Well, maybe I should have gone for. Actually, it wouldn't have made much difference anyway, because it wouldn't have reacted in time, but still, damn it. Jim or Jim. <laughs> just like in single player. Sherman played Men of War single player in a bit of a while, actually. So, a few other things to do. Oh well, anyway. Ah, of course, it's going to freaking miss. And we've got an enemy Cromwell there as well. Well, it's just freaking dandy. Damn it, something tells me we probably won't be able to survive this for too long. Well, you never know, we might still be able to. That guy's not going to survive though, that's for certain. The one on the left there. <laughs> Damn it. I'm just going to just get my own Achilles, I guess. Oh, okay, there we go, Malik here. That's something you don't see too often, to say the least. Actually, wait a minute. Am I closest to the left? I'm not entirely sure. What I spawn spawning around here? Interesting. Oh shit! Speaking of which, ah, oh, of course it fucking has to miss. Really doesn't seem to be aiming back at me. Okay, thank God that actually works. There we go. Phew. And what the hell, I'll go for this thing now. Damn, I'll have to send in some SMGs followed by rifle. Eight help left. Now, well, at least this thing's operational still, thank god for that. Damn, and of course, this point's falling now as well. Why wouldn't it? Now, we just have to sit tight. Actually, what the hell, I might as well take a pot shot at this thing. And Hope that the Sherman Firefly isn't too close nearby. But there we go, we've got Sir uh, coming in to take that, and does the actually spawn? Oh no, that's John that spawned in all on the far right. And there we go, how crush that bastard. So there we go, send him some G's, Rolfman, and we'll see what happens. I'll we'll try to separate them a bit now that. Great, a Centaurian. At least their front line isn't that great, actually, so we can still possibly get them even with a bloody uh, Achilles if need be. I think got that point still out as well. So, yeah, just keep the thing uh, behind here. These SMG guys probably should try to pull a bit more forward, pull their weight a bit, maybe. Went oh, very nice. I wonder if he's got his own Centaurian or if he. Oh no, he got it with uh, a scout. <laughs> oh, that's good. That's damn good. What the hell? Oh, of course. Now this thing's got no, no other targets, I guess we might as well go straight for this thing. <laughs> well, it's oh, and of course this thing's going to horribly miss, why wouldn't it? 
Why wouldn't I horribly miss? Okay, there we go, there goes that. This thing, I guess. I guess, fuck it, I'll send this thing up a bit more forward, see if I can take out the, um... What you call it? The Dharma or whatever the hell that's over there. Of course, it's going to horribly expose my Achilles, but what the hell, I mean. Might as well take a risk and try to take out this freaking Dharma, which is just being such a pain in the ass. So we send a few more infantry. And there we go, Bob's your uncle. Damn it, something... Oh, fuck it, me Achilles. And of course, horribly missing. I believe there's a Sherman Firefly, yep, and I'll destroy it. Yeah, well, it was worth a shot, I guess. <laughs> we could stand to heal these guys off a bit. Well, thank god I can just keep it going for more and more Achilles. <laughs> uh, and this thing is still not operational. Whoops. Damn tank men still keep getting taken out. Well, we at least managed to re secure this point, thank god, and. There we go, even got a few Rathman left over to actually uh, lay down a few sandbags. There we go. I'm not really sure why exactly I laid sandbags there in the first place. But so far forward, but uh, what the hell, we'll try to keep to that, I guess. Lay a few sandbags forward here as well, and just try not to let this uh, position fall, I guess. And what are these? Oh, these are just SMGs. Perfect. Jesus, these bastards can take a few hits, though, given that. Oh, well, anyway, maybe I can get this thing from uh, the front, maybe rather try to flank it. So send this thing forward, this thing forward. Crap loads of things dying all over the place, and it looks like this point is also... Why is this... Oh. <laughs> no, of course I can't see the repair thing. Okay, there we go. Oh, the repair thing is there anyway. Damn it. Why is this thing... Why are they being such a pain in the ass in the middle? All we want to do is hold it for, uh, for king and country. Oh well, anyway, keep, keep up the attack here I suppose. Oh, there we go, actually managed to get Sarathma to set up some stuff here. Don't know what these guys are doing, we'll just send them over here and if we can keep this firefly distracted, should be able to get a hit off on it. And even if this thing dies in the next shot, it will still be a net win. And there goes my infantryman, damn it. And of course, whoops, I forgot to tell this thing to freaking hold fire. So of course it was firing on the move and as a result it's probably going to get screwed over. Let's see if I can still get a shot. Oh, how crushed, thank god. Yeah, it's interesting, I thought the Crusader was meant to be a bit of a glass cannon tank, a very shitty one. But there you go, it's um... It only crew can two my Achilles, which has basically got next to no armor. Not bad, not bad. Well done Crusader, well done. Certainly marks um... Who's the more experienced player at not when you see people coming out with freaking Crusaders, not bad. And Crusader AIs, AAs, should I say, those things are really terrible. Anyway, let's flatten these sandbags and try to establish a new sandbag line a little bit further behind, perhaps. And we'll just run over that assault for infantry as well. Actually, what the hell, I suppose I could take the left while I'm at it. What the hell, indeed. That's right, I forgot about these SMGs. And why not? <laughs> uh, why not? So I'll still have to worry about enemy archer, of course, or Achilles, should I say. Shit, this thing spotted me. Damn it, I've been spotted. <laughs> ah, God. And thankfully... Oh, no, no, wait, that was Achilles tank getting taken out, damn it. 253 to 221. Talk about a close game, and it's been a 2 versus 3 all this time around as well. So I dare say we've been doing get one hell of a job. Hell of a job if I do say so. And I do. That's why I'm saying it actually, because I do say so. <laughs> but anyway, we'll just lay a few sandbags here. Yeah, I know I'm being a bit lazy with the sandbag placement, but uh, fuck it. Send this thing across here and see if we can take out the Sherman perhaps. Although, probably get taken out by the enemy Achilles. What the hell? See what happens. Screw it. I'll uh, just take a left. And maybe help the uh, middle from time to time. So there we go, we've got the uh, Crusader thingamajingy. Crusader AI. Uh, AA, should I say? It's not really an A, actually. Uh. And the Sherman's down as well, perfect. I dare say this thing really uh, getting the job done. Of course, pretty infantry getting, being a pain in the ass. One of my guys even getting taken out. Now, uh, what the hell, managing to get the rest of these guys on sandbags and all that, so it should be. 
pretty dandy. This guy's still laying down sandbags. He's a little trooper. I haven't even actually managed to finish. Not so bad, not so bad. Okay, there we go. I'll have to do. And let's see. We'll see if we can take out some of this stuff permanently, perhaps. Or maybe even spots, actually. Wait a minute. Oh, this thing. This thing's dead. Damn it. And seeing as my is not repairing it, I guess I'll repair it myself. But yeah, that thing's definitely permanently dead, though. Uh, great. So now we've got this thing to worry about. And hull crushed, of course. Damn it. It's too bad I didn't give these tankmen anything. Otherwise, I would have been able to take this thing out quick smart. I'll send him some SMGs here. Oh, and there goes the hell on that. Damn it, that's just an iconic. Yeah, well, I suppose I can at least get a dynamite from that, and let's just keep on going. Oh, actually, I can get my instant touring if I want. Ah, oh, fuck it, why not? Might as well pull out all the stops to uh, try to win, and is that my. Oh, that's my nice sending infantry. This thing is still. Oh no, it has been repaired, who'd think? <laughs> so the Centurion, I suppose, yeah, I can just continue on with the mid-left course. These guys can continue moving on as well. Freaking artillery is going to pain in the ass, taking out crap loads of guys. And maybe we might just set this thing to HE5. I'll just have to be more careful than our opponents have been, of course, with uh, with their uh, Centurion satellites. Now, what the hell is this? Oh, okay, that's right, just then. Willy's MB theme jiggy. Not bad. Alright, let's take this thing out quick smart. Okay, let's try again to take it out quick smart, send a few more infantry. Damn it, we're still getting screwed on the middle though. And seven minutes to go though, this is still anyone's game, of course. But still the fact that we've been doing this well even with a two versus three, yeah, certainly speaks volumes about how we're actually playing, so what the hell? Not too shabby if I do so so. Oh, there's the commanders as well, damn it. Actually, a land mattress wouldn't hurt. Eh, well, oh, okay, freaking diamond, of course. What the hell will, uh. So these bastards over here. Sent a few more, there we go. Which why is this thing fucking aiming at the diamond? I don't know. There we go, hell destroyed, so it took their freaking time. And there we go, actually, yeah, used up all my points already. Got a Sherman Firefly coming in against Grey Wolf's Grey Wolf, Sherman Firefly. So who's sending in the rockets? Okay, so it looks like John Connor. Well, the Terminator is sending in the uh, rockets. And this thing. Why isn't it 50 cal? There we go, fucking. Now he's up to 50 cal, I don't you? Okay, well, uh, we'll leave these guys back here and wait for the inevitable. Rockets, and hopefully it should give us just enough to firepower to capture that. Shit. Come on, get your freaking rockets set up, you bastard. And freaking commanders, of course, why not? And there goes that. Rockets, that's it, damn it. Should I be better off with a uh, Olicon, actually? Ah, there we go, finally. I'll destroy that. Track damaged on that, and see how the rest of the stuff goes. Oh my god, I actually managed to make it uh, all the way over here. That might be able to capture some of these points over here. The three points, should I say. Okay, maybe not the amount of freaking SMGs out of there. Damn it. I forgot about that guy, too. Uh, not bad. Okay, there we go. Now I'm out of chance. 253 to 335, though, still anyone's game, that's satellite. Certainly anyone's game, still. Don't know even where that uh, Achilles shot even came from, to be honest. <laughs> yeah, well. And yeah, go tank room and go. Kill that SMG. Uh, but, oh, not get down there. Down it goes, of course, damn it. Fuck it, here comes some more SMGs. Good old SMG spam. And really, commandos, of course. Ah, fuck, that's right, I forgot how great their weapons are. Against basically everything. <laughs> yep, here come more SMGs. Goodness me, the SMGs. Try to secure that, damn it. Hopefully the Solikion should be able to make a bit of a difference once it actually comes onto the field. Thankfully my guys there managing to survive, managing to hold on to the left as well. Okay, not too shabby if I do say so. 
And there we go, Grey Wolf is managing to use his uh, vehicle to someone's better effect than me, not that. Not bad indeed. Although, oh, thank god, point is still alive, there we go. And yep, looks like this point is good too, thank god for that. Alright, so we'll set up a few more sandbags and yeah, use, use this Olikion to sort of uh, cover them, I guess. In fact, what the hell, I'll even send in a second Olikion. It's a Lycaon Madness, as you can see. Damn, it looks like they're capturing this point, though. Yeah, to me, it's been rather interesting how they're capitalizing on their uh, lack of defense on the left there. The enemy team must have also realized that's, uh... Ah, oh, for fuck's sake. Must have realised that um, the guy who uh, quit or lagged out or whatever, whatever the hell happened to him, that he was actually uh, on the left, and yeah, it looks like the enemy team acted accordingly, which is just uh, freaking deadly speaking. Which here we've also got our own Achilles, which will say Fireflies getting get taken out, as illustrated by that uh, nice little fire explosion there. Not too shabby. Four minutes to go there, they've still got a freaking lead on us, though. <sighs> Definitely anyone's game, though. Definitely anyone's game. So much so that even bears repeating. <laughs> Still got one SMG left, probably won't be able to do too much with them, but what the hell, we'll see what happens. Here we go, thank god this Olikion's here. Another one incoming. Come on, fucking kill the team, bastard. And of course, now he's dead. Hmm, don't have too much of my guys there, for that matter. Yeah, well. And enemy artillery is still going to be a pain in the ass, of course. Oh, well. oh yes, very uh, good efforts by opponents, uh, managing to get artillery and yeah, very good use of um, managing to use artillery very well, shall I say. And yeah, very good use of um, you, the British uh, tank destroyers as well, very nicely done if I do say so. This guy for some reason is managing to really uh, knock the stuffing out of my guys, and of course now he's fracking going to get killed off. Of course. Now this is Olikian should be able to do a bit of damage. And is this is it still alive? No, it's completely dead, of course. Now what the hell, I suppose I can just uh, keep sending out Olikians while I'm at it. How's that for a winning strategy? Just, just uh, spam Olikians, like there's no tomorrow. Damn it, frick. Ah, oh, of course this thing's in the way. Oh, they actually did get taken out. And there goes one even teams. And just in time really, because as you can see we are a bit on the ropes when it comes to uh, actually no, shit, I didn't want them to use that. Yeah, a bit on the ropes when it comes to uh, points and all that. It is incredibly close. I don't know if we actually would have uh, won or not, and damn enemy love, of course. Never get tired of them. So it's tank trim, I guess we might as well send them over here as well. Shit. This thing is really meant to be firing against Oh, uh, sorry, firing at these bastards, of course. Oh, well. And, of course, freaking middle is getting captured. Damn it. Might as well some stormtroopers, I suppose. And what the hell, we'll just keep up these Olikions, I guess. <laughs> uh, not bad, in fact, they've sent an Achilles to take out that bastard's Achilles. There we go. Yes, sir. Oh, shit, we're starting to run low on our Olikions, though. No, the humanity shit, and we're almost, we almost. There we go. We almost uh, have the points that we need. Yay. Actually, wait a minute, I'll have to get some uh, SMGs too while we're at it. We are, that's right, there it is. Okay, well, what the hell, let him send that stuff over there. I'll send my guys over here, we'll slowly capture this point. 319 to 339, it's going to be a bit of a close one. Now, where was that Daimler I wonder? I don't know. Oh shit, what I do know. Freaking bastards trying to capture this point, damn it. Oh, and there's the freaking Daimler, of course. I think, yeah, that's it, yeah. Oh, there we go, I guess we'll take it over 50 count then, which is convenient in place in the back of this turret. Ah, uh, fuck, and, yep, of course, very nice position for their own Achilles as well. Yes, it certainly will be close. Blame me for trying. Really. It was trying.
trolling was that's just freaking dandy. Okay, anyway, at least we've got guys here to re to capture, thank god. These commandos should actually be shooting, maybe. What can we hope? And there we go, perfect. We shouldn't even bother repairing that thing, but what the hell. And there we go, my Olykion's up there as well. Victor Mando. In fact, we've actually got three Olykions. <laughs> I need to think I'll even send in some more SMGs towards the middle too. There we go. Perfect. So these bastards up here. What are these guys? Just regular SMGs. This thing is probably not going to get repaired in time. Actually, no, it almost certainly is not going to get repaired in time. Oh, what the hell? We can still use it. Oh, that down it goes. Damn it. And they seem to have freaking pinpoint accuracy as well, which is just dandy. And what the hell? We'll uh, try and distract them with this diamond as well. What the hell? Ah, oh, Valentine. Well, who knows? I might be able to ambush him, maybe. <laughs> what can I hope? There we go. If we can at least hold them up a bit. 339, 339. Going to have this. Yep, there we go. We started winning. Damn it. Still going to be close. They half a minute left. Two Valentines. Yeah, this thing doesn't really stand a chance. Damn it. Make sure I should go up against this thing. Okay, maybe not. Okay, go grenade. Fly straight and true. Those guys actually got, say, AT grenades, two of them. Shit. Oh, there are my guys. Shit, I forgot to send them forward, actually. Hell, at least. Sorry, oh well, should I say the uh, left is held and. <laughs> oh, thank god the match didn't go on for a bit longer. Why isn't this thing freaking taking out these tanks now that I think of it? Oh, 347 to 342. Incredible, and that Aknix on the enemy team to 544 points compared to my 37. Yep, he certainly knows how to use UK, I'll give him that. Incredible game, I hope you've watched that from be sorry, beginning to end. And I'll uh, see you next time.